What's going on, everybody? So today I'm going to do something different. Today I'm going to be teaching everybody about the brokerage side. I know all of you guys that have been listening to me, I've been teaching you about the truck game. Today I'm going to teach you how to make money in this brokerage industry. Just last month, off my brokerage alone, I made $54,000. I will put the receipts in this group set so you guys can see because everything I come with, I come with numbers. Enclosed right here are loads that I personally sold to carriers. They're called bill of ladings and PODs, which is proof of deliveries. So this is how it basically works. From A to Z, I'm going to teach you guys. I personally charge $2,000 to number one, get your brokerage activated, get you bonded, get you insurance, get you escort your MC because a brokerage has a different MC than what a carrier MC does. I can help you get set up with carriers, which are truck drivers. I can get you set up with shippers and teach you the game. The way I did it is I had my own truck, and every time I was at the mercy of other brokers by calling them and saying, hey, can you please give me this amount of money? Can you please give me that amount of money? It wasn't working. They were, I was basically at their mercy, and they were giving me whatever they felt like giving me. Now, I have eight trucks. Now that I have my own brokerage, I pick the broker, the loads that I want. I put it on my truck. The other ones that I don't want them, I put them up for sale. The way you do that is you post them on a website called either Keep Trucking, but the main one we all know is Power.dat, and you sell it there. Now, a lot of haters are going to come here and say, oh, double broker. We're not talking about double brokering. Double brokering is if you book a load with your carrier MC for, let's say, five grand, and you post it back on a web page, and you sell it for four grand. We're not doing that. The way I'm teaching you is the right way. So... If you pay 2K, now everybody knows when the trucking, I said you need to pay me the 1500 and you need to have $20,000 behind you for the truck, trailer, all that. For a brokerage, you don't need none of that. You don't need a truck. You don't need a trailer. You don't need a driver. You don't even need the insurance. All you need is a bond. Based on what your credit score is, if you have a good credit score, your bond, which is going to be once a year, it basically protects you if anything happens to the load that you're selling to a carrier. If you have good credit, your bond is going to be like 27, 2800 bucks, which you only pay once a year. For the $2,000 that you're going to pay me, this is what you get. I activate your MC. I activate your S Corp. I get all the paperwork ready to go. I, sign, I take care of everything for you. Once that's said and done, for the first six months to eight months, no carrier is going to want to do a load with you because you have no credit. So even if you post a good load up and the carrier calls you and says, hey, I love the price you're paying. I'm willing to do the load, but hey, you don't have no credit. What do we do, right? What I can offer you is with my factoring, you could tell that carrier, hey, as soon as you go to the warehouse and you pick that load up, I will pay you 50% up front. Soon as you go deliver the load and send me the POD, I will pay you the other 50%. This way, everybody is honest. Nobody burns nobody. If you think that there's anybody else doing that besides me, call my bluff. Get on the board and call any broker that doesn't have credit with factoring and tell them, hey, I'm willing to do your load, but you don't have credit. Do you do 50-50 upon pickup and upon delivery? I guarantee you they're all going to say no. I am the only one who offers that to my clients. For the first six, seven months, you're going to pay these drivers with my help up front and then tell them to put comments on your brokerage saying that you got paid up front. And not only is your factoring going to start working with you, but your credit is going to go through the roof. At any time, if you don't want to work at this brokerage no more, you're going to sell that brokerage, eyes closed, minimum $30,000, $40,000, eyes closed. Just post it, say, I got a brokerage for sale. It has good credit. No questions asked, $40,000, they'll go. So this is the way it goes. You pay me the money. I get all that working for you. Now, like every other business, you need to get on the ground and start hustling. Like if you open up an electronics company or a plumbing company, you need to go around and get customers, correct? This is the way you do it. After I get everything ready for you, you go in your city, in your state, wherever you live at, go to these stores such as Amazon, uh, uh, Costco, Target, Marshalls, uh, Macy's, whatever stores you got. The way I would do it is I would hit these warehouses, these shippers, with a cold box of water with ice in a, in a thing and walking around with it, giving out free water and telling them, look, my name is so-and-so. Uh, how much do you guys charge to move these loads from your company in, let's say, Los Angeles to Boston? Out of eight of them, they could say no, but all it takes is one or two of them to say, you know what? I'm willing to work with you. You tell them I have my own brokerage. 
Here's my bond. Here's my credit. Give this a try. I'll do it for three, four hundred dollars cheaper. All it takes, ten of them can say no to you. All it takes is for one of or two of them to say yeah to you. They're going to give you a load. You're going to sell it on your brokerage. You're going to give it to some carriers. They're going to deliver the load. They're going to send you the POD, which is this right here. See this? This is called a bill of lading right here. This is a POD. You're going to sell it to these drivers. And FYI, before any of these people on this shit say watch is fake, $30,000, man. You could come close. Fake watch busters could get that too, thirty k But anyways, this is a bill of lading. This is the fuel that I give my drivers. This is fuel receipts that you give them so they can make the they can make the gas. Once that's said and done, you send this to the broker, and I mean broker. I'm sorry, you are the broker. You send this to the shipper. Give it to them. They're gonna see it. They're gonna verify everything. They're gonna pay you, and then you're gonna pay your carrier. Because but remember though, that's after you get credit. But if you don't have credit, I'm gonna help you pay your carrier up front, so you don't never lose. You're going to hit every market, every store, every place that you think got action. You're going to just go over there, speak to the manager at shipping. Say, hey, I have my own brokerage. Give me a chance. Let me work. You know, the way I started is everybody almost said no to me. I had two or three of them that said yeah to me. They would give me one load, two loads. They seen the way I did it. Next thing you know, now they call me. Hey, do you have, you know, availability for another 10 loads? Yes, I'll take them. Next thing you know, they could call you, hey, for this month, I'm going to have 20 of them. Can you do it? And this is how you build relationships with brokers. Now, when you have your own brokerage and you're getting your own loads, you could get yourself a truck or if you already have a truck, put those same loads on your truck so you don't got to beg anybody else for loads. And then once your trucks are all filled up, you can sell the rest of these loads. Every single month, you can make minimum thirty, forty thousand dollars $40,000 at home. I wake up at four in the morning because I'm in, you know, I'm in Los Angeles, so I gotta be up at four in the morning because in the East Coast it's already at seven o'clock, and I'm on the phones. The loads that my shippers give me, I post them. I make sure I get a good driver when they call me. I check on the FMCSA. I check on Safer. I check on Carrier 411. I make sure that the carrier I'm giving it to is responsible, doesn't have any tickets for accidents, and I give them the load. I make sure they deliver, and I get paid. I'm at home doing this now, mind you. I was in prison for nine years. When I got out, I had welding certificates from prison. I thought I was going to be a welder. Nobody wanted to give me a job because of the way I looked at my tattoos. So when I started doing this from home, I realized I'm with my family 24-7. I'm not out there doing dirty work in the rain, in the, in the snow, in the hot heat. I'm home with my family. This is the best opportunity. I would strongly recommend you guys do it. Now, People always ask me, why are you giving out game for free? Why? The reason I'm doing it is because I had nobody helping me. I had nobody giving me a chance. And I have children I needed to take care of, a beautiful wife I needed to take care of, and nobody wanted to help me. Now that I know the game plan, I'm paying it forward. I don't care how many clients sign up and start doing this. America moves on this trucking and uh, industry and broken industry. So I'm not going to be hurting. All I'm trying to do is help other people. Yes, you're going to have haters in this comments. You're going to have the miserable people who have nothing else to do but to speak negative. But I'm doing this for the people, the single dads, single moms, the, uh, the parents who want to help their children, help their kids live a better life. After coming out of prison, after doing nine years, man, I have million dollars in my bank account. I have Lamborghini, McLaren, Corvette. I have this beautiful fucking house that I'm living at. Why not give that blessing to other people? If you got any questions? Hit me up on my Instagram. It's at H-U-S-T-L-E underscore underscore N-O-M-I-K-S. That's hustle underscore underscore nomics. Please do not message me unless you're going to come with a payment. I got so many customers that I just don't got no time to go back and forth. Hit me up on Instagram. Hit me up on TikTok. Tell me you're ready to go. The second I get payment, I will FaceTime you with my team. We will pick a company name for you guys. We will check and see with FMCSA that you're allowed to use these names, and we will get to work. We'll take care of the bond. We'll take care of the payments. We'll take care of the S-Corp, and we'll get you going. Anybody have any question? hit me up in my comments. If I could answer them, I'll answer them to you. Other than that, God bless you, and stay safe. Peace.